Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a huge jean haul for you guys. Okay, let's start off first with the top I'm wearing now. I will pop everything up on this side so you can see what it's called. This has to be the most favorite top that I own so far. I love it. It looks good. It makes the girls look good. As you can see in the back, there is like the string so you could adjust if you need it bigger or smaller in the reviews a lot of girls were saying you know size up size up and i was really scared like should i should i not but i definitely did size up and i do not regret it at all so i'm normally a medium but i got a large this top i would say is definitely more for girls with smaller boobs but it still looks good it has like this lacy material it's definitely not the most comfortable thing, unfortunately. It has like this underwire that I am not a big fan of. If I would have to rate this 1 out of 10, because it's not the most comfortable thing, but I love it, I would have to give it an 8 out of 10. Okay, next we have this black one piece. It's super cute. It is thin, but it wasn't really that see-through. It is off the shoulder as you can see but it still has some sleeve i definitely recommend wearing this in the summer because it'll be way too cold in the winter it's nice material it's comfortable i can wear this whenever um but yes i definitely recommend it and i would rate it a 10 out of 10. okay next we have this red crop top I think this is super cute. When I got it, it did come untied, so you could tie it however you would like in the front. This is the back. It does come with chain, so unfortunately it is not adjustable or anything like that. It wasn't too thin, it wasn't see-through. Um, I also have got the same top, but in black. The material is really comfortable. It's definitely, again, a summer thing. I would also recommend getting these and I would rate them a 10 out of 10. Super cute. So this next one is a little different from what I would normally get, but I seen it on the model and I just, I had to get it. It, it looks super cute. So it's a two piece and first this is the top. It says challenge. The neon yellow or green stood out to me and it comes with these bottoms same thing challenge the little buckle it was really comfortable it feels more of like a like a swimsuit material but it's not a swimsuit but i mean you can still use it it really stood out again like i love the way it looked on the model and here is a picture of something I posted on my Instagram to see how it looks like but it was super cute I I don't regret getting it again the material was really nice I liked it it's not my favorite outfit but if I had to rate it I would give it an 8 out of 10 so this next thing that I have is like this little crop top here's the back has a zipper so it's adjustable so if you want to show some cleavage or you don't you could always adjust it this i want to say is very comfortable out of all the outfits i had also got it in orange again like this was another thing that i just love the way it looked on the model it just looks so cute the material is super soft and comfortable i can wear it all day long without having any problem if i had to rate these i would rate them a 10 out of 10. now next i had got this two piece workout set here are the bottoms they say they both say sport on them um i think they're really comfortable, great to work out in. I think they make you look really good, um, especially if you want to match. It's a great set. Um, I did go work out in these and I had no problems. They were super comfortable, great to move around in. The material is really nice and soft. I did get a few compliments and overall I love them and I would rate them a 9 out of 10. 
So the next thing I got was this two-piece swimsuit. Um, here are the bottoms. Unfortunately, I could not find what it's called, but I will pop up a picture of how it looks. The material was really nice. It also comes with the padding on the top. I did go swim in it and it was comfortable, had no problems. I think it's great, especially if you're the type of person who doesn't like to show a lot when you go out swimming because this does cover a lot, especially in the bottom too, because they're shorts, you don't have to worry about exposing yourself. But overall, they're great and I would rate them an eight out of 10. So for the next thing, what I wanted to do was to get a whole bunch of different pieces and make my own bunny costume. So for the top, I had gotten this. It does button down here at the bottom. And I paired it with these fishnets and these really big bunny ears. Um, Unfortunately, the bunny ears were way too big for me. I didn't really like the length, so I ended up purchasing some other ones that were a lot a lot shorter, but the material was really nice. I was afraid of how it was going to fit and look on me and how much it was going to expose, but it came out working really great. The fishnets were great too. Um, I've never worn fishnets before, so it was a little confusing on how to put them on, but eventually when I got it, the outfit turned out great. I will definitely be popping up a picture here so you guys can see the final look with all three. Overall, the bunny costume is exactly what I was looking for and I would rate it, uh, I would say a 10 out of 10. I love the way it came out. So that was it for the clothes and I do have a few other things I'm going to show you guys. So I had gotten these hoop earrings. Let me take them out so I can show you. So here they are up closer. You can see how they have these little gems. I'm not sure if you guys can see. But I was so excited to get these because I've never really owned a pair of hoop earrings and I love the way they look on other people. But unfortunately, I did not like these. Don't get me wrong, they're, you know, they're super cute and shiny. But when I try to put them on, like, it hurt. When I go and put on my normal earrings, they go in easy. But for some reason, like, I don't know if this these like this part is a lot thicker than normal earrings, but it just hurt and by the time I got it in, my ear was all red and hurting and I just I did not like it. So I am going to be rating these um a one out of ten. Okay, so next I had gotten um a couple of sets of makeup brushes. If you guys go check out my TikTok, I did make a video of unpackaging those. Um, but I will show you guys again. Um, these were pink. Pink is my favorite color, so of course I had to get these. I definitely recommend them. I had also got these bright neon brushes. Again, both sets of brushes comes with a whole bunch of different styles for eyeshadow, you know, whatever shape, size, whatever you need. I had seen a girl unbox these ones. Um, it took me a long time to find them, but I just fell in love with the bright neon. And again, I definitely recommend both of them, a 10 out of 10. Okay, then I had gotten this purple brush holder to hold all of my brushes. I think it's super cute. It was the easiest to put together, only like a couple of pieces, but I definitely recommend it. It does hold a lot of brushes. I had put all my brushes in here and still had a lot of extra room for others. So I would give this a 10 out of 10. Okay guys, so next we have my lashes. They are the ones that I am wearing right now. I will be popping up a better picture so you guys can see. These are the first lashes I've ever worn that were really long and dramatic. Usually if I do wear lashes, they'll be really tiny. But overall, I really love these. They're definitely something I will have to get used to, but they're super cute. Um, especially if you're somebody who likes long, dramatic lashes. They were really nice and really affordable. So far, I really like them. They've been great. I definitely recommend them. and. I would rate these lashes, I would say a 10 out of 10. 
Okay guys, that was it for today's video. Hope you guys liked everything. Um, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be leaving all my social medias down below. Bye!